After the war, Amelia attended Columbia University for a brief period, intending to study medicine, but she did not complete her degree. It was during a visit to an airfare in Long Beach with her father in 1920 that Amelia's passion for aviation was truly ignited. After a 10-minute flight that cost her father $10, Amelia knew she had to fly. She worked various jobs, including as a truck driver and photographer, to save for flying lessons. Under the guidance of her instructor, Neta Snook, a pioneering female aviator, Amelia quickly excelled in flying, purchasing her first plane, a second-hand Kinner Airster, which she affectionately named the Canary. <laughs>